So we're asked to find 35% of 260. So we know 100% is 260. So I'm going to first of all find 10%. And to do that, I'm going to just divide the 100 by 10 and the 260 by 10. So 10% would be 260 divided by 10, which is 26. Uh, and then I'm going to work out 5%, because I'll need 35, so I need to find that 5. And all I'm going to do is just halve the 10% to get 5%. So half of 26 is 13. Now 30%, uh, I'm then going to have to get that 10% and times it by 3. So I'm going to get that 10% and I'm going to times that by 3. And I can just do it over here. 20, oh, do want 30. I want 26 times by 3. So 3 times 6 is 18. 3 times 2 is 6, plus the 1 is 7. So that's going to be 78. And if you've got a different way of multiplying using maybe the grid method, that's absolutely fine. So I can quickly show the grid method here. So 26 would be 20 and 6 times 3 should be 60, 18, and then 60 plus the 18 is also 78. Okay, so to get uh, 35, we need to add the 5 and the 30 together. So we need to add this amount and this amount, and that would give us 35%. So we need to do 13 plus 78. So 3 plus 8 is 11, so 1 and then 1 down here, 7, 8, 9, so it would be 91. So our answer is going to be 91.